Hello, and welcome to Astronomy for Kids with Dr. Richard Pearson. Almost all of the planets in the solar system have moons. You can go and watch our other video that talks about the number of moons, and you can find out exactly how many each planet has. But how do the planets get moons? Astronomers have three ways to explain this. One, through a collision. Two, through a capture. And three, through a process called accretion. Now this video is about collision. We believe the Earth obtained its moon through a massive collision with another object that was about the size of Mars. I put together a short, small clip to illustrate this, so let's go there. Here is our Sun, and here is our Earth, billions of years before it looked like it does today. An object which has been called Theia or Theia collided with the Earth or slammed into the Earth. All the debris or wreckage from the collision collected around the Earth and became the Moon. Now we know through analysis of moon rocks from the astronauts that went to the Moon and brought them back that the Earth and the Moon are made of the same stuff. This collision formation hypothesis is how we explain why. So there's an example of a moon forming for massive collision. Now, if you have questions about this or anything else, please leave them here in the comment section, or you can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash astronomy for kids. If you want to make sure not to miss the other videos about capture and accretion, then please subscribe. And don't forget, hit the like button. Thanks for watching Astronomy for Kids with Dr. Richard Pearson.